channel in today's session let's see ibm interview experience for freshers in 2024 without getting delay let's get into this video first common question is introduction to yourself so this is the basic question in any sort of interview you should be prepared enough for any interview this for this question okay so the time frame for this question should be between 45 seconds to one minute not longer than that okay the second question is tell about your projects so if you are in fourth year and giving in some sort of interviews you can give your project details about maybe you will have mini project or some internships so you can explain about them if you are after your fourth year or after your degree you can give your major project and mini project details at this point of time coming to the third question is role and responsibilities in your project you should be aware of it right you are doing the work in the project you should be aware of your role and your responsibilities it should be in a constructive way when you are answering this question the fourth question is what is constructor in python this is a basic question you will be uh, able to answer if you are familiar with the python language okay the next question is what does the hash symbol do in python so this is also a basic uh, familiar beginner questions uh, if you are familiar with the python you will be able to answer all these questions here which are uh, seen on the screen the next question is difference between list and tuple so this question mark it as very important you must be aware of this question because maximum 99 percent of interviewers if you mention python as your skill set this question will be the must question for beginners let's see the next question this is a writing code question the next one is a write primary number code in python so this will be a completing within two to three lines the interviewer will be asking to share your screen and open the notepad and to write the code otherwise uh, the uh, interface itself will be having the some sort of coding um, uh, section you can write the code there interviewer can see your code so even though if it is wrong that's not an issue but you should be able to explain it uh, like how you can uh, trigger the output okay make sure these are very basic uh, questions for interviews you will be finding lot of questions in Google if you find like basic uh, coding questions for uh, freshers in Python like that you will be getting like 10 to 20 questions you can prepare for that okay not more than that every interviewer know that you are an uh, fresher so that you will be getting uh, questions from them itself. The next question is difference between mutable and immutable data type. Next is difference between for and while loop. So this is a commonly known question. You should be able to answer this for and while loop and the data types also, okay? The next question is, do you have any backlogs? next is biggest achievement in your life so it can be anything uh, any achievement in your life maybe like um, you are the first uh, candidate who have scored uh, in c language hackathons or in python language hackathons you might be the first right you can mention those in this particular achievement that might be your achievement that is your personal you can be uh, either you can mention your personal thing uh, if you have any sort of achievement like you might be the first uh, district level throw ball player that thing it can be anything here okay and the final question is uh, any questions uh, do you have to ask me so interviewer is asking that do you have any questions to the uh, attendee you can ask at this point if you have any questions uh, like what is the process next and how much time it will take to get an update uh, about the interview like that you can make it as an interactive session at this point okay the next thing is i need to tell you this is totally a fresher interview experience uh, 
this is from one of my student uh, reference so this could be varying according to your interviewer and resume i'll be telling you about this point in every video because um, people might uh, few people might uh, fix that these are the questions that will be taking up in the interviews but no this will be changing according to your resume highlights and the interviewer but these are the uh, fresher interview experiences okay so if you want more interview experiences i can uh, share um, if you want uh, experiences uh, questions uh, you can ask me in the comment section like uh, i have accenture interview questions i'll be linked in the description i have my own interview experience with ibm accenture emphasis if you want them also i can link up in the description okay the mainly focus thing is first and foremost thing is body language and smile so these two plays a main role in the total interview body language like gestures and how you sit how you give eye contact these all plays a very vital role in the interview uh, coming to the smile it gives a pleasant environment to either to the interviewer and you will be feel relaxed if you have a smile on your face it shows a presentable manner to the interview okay next one is you should be aware of at least one new technology basics at least i'm saying i'm not saying you should know entire technology at least a basic what are the types and how it is used and why it is used uh, what is the uh, importance for this why it is important uh, like why it is booming all these sort of basic questions you should be able to understand so for example of new technologies i would say power bi artificial intelligence machine learning and all these things okay the third thing is project if you have mini project major project internships you should be having knowledge in depth okay this is your project you are doing it of course you should have knowledge on it okay the fourth and final important thing is being interactive the interview session should be as an interactive session okay it should not be a question and answer session it should be like a friendly interactive session that doesn't mean you can ask whatever questions you have there should be some certain of professionalism whenever you ask any question at this particular sort of time okay and if you have any more questions you can visit our channel we have lot of interview experiences uh, videos like ibm accenture infosys uh, emphasis etc if you have any sort of questions you can you can comment down below i'll be available to answer you and uh, if you want any preferences videos also please comment me i'll be able to do those videos on any job updates okay if you want job updates please let me know i'll post everyday videos on them uh thank you for watching this video hope you'll enjoy this video and it will be helpful for you in future thank you so much